Okay, so you have all these wires here. This will be one bundle. You know which one it is due to this TXT60 connector. You then have this wire here, which this is a separate wire. Now, given it's black, simply plug it in to the positive terminal here, slide it in, and tighten it down. You then are going to keep in mind this green wire. And then this goes into the negative section of, of your uh, DC to DC converter. And the whole point of the DC to DC converter is to step down the voltage from 12 volts to five. Insert your negative into the contact. Do not be afraid to loosen these. Simply tighten down on the contact and wire. And then this entire harness here will be what your battery, which looks like this, will hook up to. This connector here will be secured to the top panel up here. This should not be press fit and make sure to test how this fits before gluing it in place. Hello everyone, Future Tyler here. Just a quick note on the TX60 connector that we use for the charger and for the battery charging in the smart case, right? You have your female end and you have your male end that go together like this. What's important is, is that in this re re reassembly of the smart case, I was not able to glue it in. So I'm gonna show you real quickly how to do that. This is the female end of the TX60 connector that will be in your smart case. This connector is going to slide in to that little hole there on your 3D printed piece, right? We, we include epoxy for you to do this and it should fit in there very loosely. The reason being is that if it's too tight, the connectors won't be able to connect together properly. So you're gonna insert it a little something along the lines of this only after this piece has been mounted because in case there's a little, you know, glue that goes um, over the part, the, these pieces then won't be able to mount correctly. Another disclaimer too that I just wanna point out is that epoxy is very sticky and is not good for your skin. If you get any of it on your hands at any point, please go wash your hands immediately.